Thank you for this day, Lord, for the many choices and the great many choices that you've given us. We pray for peace by the blood of Jesus Christ. We pray for godliness when we get flustered and, and worried and delayed, Father God, in Jesus' name. We pray for those who are using Comrade to soak my feet, and I pray for those who will soak with this video. Lord, silence every voice of the Holy Holy Spirit and decrease by increasing the glory of Jesus' mighty name. I give all the glory and honor and praise. So, uh, all right, so I got two messages, but I'm going to just make another video for the next one, all right, because these don't need to go together. First Timothy 2, 5 through 8. For there was one God and one mediator between God and men, the man Christ Jesus, who gave himself as a who gave himself a ransom for all to be testified in due time. Whereunto I am ordained a preacher and an apostle, I speak the truth in Christ and lie not, a teacher of the Gentiles in faith and verity. I will therefore that men pray everywhere, lifting up holy hands without wrath and doubting. All right. You know, it's no mistake that uh, after I gave you guys that word the other day about confidence, right? Positivity, that I got attacked, of course, right? But beyond that, all right, that's how you know you're doing something right. Okay. The enemy wasn't attacking you. There's something wrong. Right? Unless it's a, unless it, God has had you in a season of um you know, in that type of season, right? But we know that there always there will always be attacks, okay? That's what catapults us forward. So I want you to pay attention to the last one I read, 8. I will therefore that men pray everywhere, lifting up holy hands without wrath and doubting. Okay? I know it can be frustrating. Okay? Waiting and not knowing if you are going in the right direction. Okay? Thank you, Holy Spirit. So, think of it like this. Holy Spirit just gave me something. You know how God will, you know how sometimes God will be silent, right? And it'll feel like he's not listening or he's not around, right? But we know that he is, okay? And we're wondering if we're going in the right direction, if we're making the right decisions, okay? Think about when you, was, you weren't making the right decisions, right? God was loud to you then, right? You know you heard him then, right? Like, turn around, nope, wrong direction. Or nope, don't go this way, right? But if he's silent, okay? And you're not sure what direction you're going and if it's the right direction, know that if you're going in the wrong direction, that God will let you know it. Okay? He will let you know it, all right? Holy Spirit told me that you will, you shall, what did I write down? You shall reap good fruit. Okay? You shall reap good fruit. Keep following the path God set out for you. Keep walking in the direction that you're walking. Okay? Because you're going the right way. Okay? Don't mistake God's silence for you going in the wrong direction. Okay? 444 of the timer. This is where faith is required. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is where faith is required. All right? And I'm not just speaking to y'all. I'm speaking to me too. All right? Anything I come up here and tell you guys, I'm absolutely speaking to myself as well. All right? I'm 
not exempt from anything that I'm up here speaking about. Okay? And don't think that I've got it all together. All right? I don't ever want anybody to look at me and think that I've got it all together. Oh, I want to be like him. He's got it all. No, I don't. I don't. Okay? But I'm striving. Every day. All right? Just like you are. Okay? And you will reap good fruit. You will. It is your harvest season. Okay? I'm going to mention that in the next message. All right? So I'm going to cut this one short there. Um, just know that you're walking in the right direction. Okay? And if you weren't, God will let you know that. All right? 5.55 on my timer. You have the grace. Thank you, Holy Spirit. God is adding more grace to you. Okay? He's adding more grace to you. Okay? So be confident in that. All right? And don't let the enemy throw you off. Okay? Yes, you will be attacked. All right? But come back. All right? Shake it off and come back. When you don't feel like praying, pray. Okay? Even if you're mad. Start saying the prayer in your head and then let it come out of your mouth. But pray. All right? All right. Love you guys. Any minute, peace.